here I am at Grand Dance Beach in Grenada, one of the most world famous Caribbean beaches. Um, yeah, lucky me. <laughs> uh, okay, I gotta really something cool for you guys today. Now, when you wake up, before too long, well, when you wake up, your your head kind of looks like this. Your brain, everything, everything's quite clear. Well, at least kind of clear. And as your day gets going, you know, your kids turn around, you're making breakfast, you're thinking about all the things you gotta do, your, your boss tells you to do something, your wife tells you to do something, whatever it is, all of a sudden your head starts to shake up, shake up, and that nice, clear feeling is not there anymore. Now that's your, that's your day. On and on, on and on, on and on. It's like chaos all day long. Now, what I recommend, and of course biking is one of the best things to do about it, is give your head a chance to clear out I call it the zen-like state when you're biking and everything just exits your mind, everything's clear. That is fantastic. If you can't get away for a bike ride and you only got five, ten minutes, the other thing you can do is just sit still. Because look what happens when you sit still. You sit still for like five, ten minutes and boom, everything just starts settling down. That sandy feeling in your head starts to go away and boom, within too long, everything's clear again. So. If you can't get away for a bike ride, or even if you do get away for the bike ride early in the day, late in the day, in the middle of the day, just take 5-10 minutes, just sit down, you don't have to meditate, do anything crazy like that, just sit down, relax, clear your head, and I'll guarantee you that everything will be focused once again, you'll be clear, you won't feel like your day is chaotic, and things are cool. So, yeah, that's just part of the thing about loving life on and off the bike, and let's do it.